Hello friends. In this video, let us learn about Selective Laser Centering that is SLS technology. SLS is a powder based printing technology. Here we are using production grade plastic materials such as nylon, polyamide so we can able to fabricate functional parts. These powder materials produced by using cryogenic grinding method. We are using carbon dioxide laser here to heat the powder particles below the melting point and we are making bonding here. Centering mechanism. Initially, the powder will be spreaded over the building platform. The laser source will pass over the powder particles. Due to this laser source, boundary of the powder particles gets micro melted. The viscosity is reduced and the neck is formed here between the powder particles. Particle 1 and particle 2 is there. When the laser source is passed over the powder particles, boundary of the particles getting micro melting and neck is formed between the powders and the joining is made between the powder particles. This is the process happened selectively over the spreaded building platform and the layer is constructed. This process is repeated until the object completely built. Now let us see here important components which construct this SLS technology. The main first component is powder container. In powder container there will be a three compartment compartment one compartment two compartment three compartment one and three will be completely filled with the raw material. It may be polyamide or nylon. Initially, one and three piston will be at bottom and second piston is uh, called object building platform. Initially, it will be at top. Leveling roller. The purpose of leveling roller is to spread out the powder particles over the building platform. This leveling roller will move from left to right, right to left to make a uniform layer over the building platform. It will uh, spread out the raw material over the building platform. Pulsating laser. This is the laser. This laser gun will receive the signal from the CAD file and the pulsate the laser. Reflecting XY mirror. This reflecting XY mirror will adjust itself and uh, focuses the laser over the building platform and draws the layer. This process is repeated until the object completely built. See here, the laser source falls on the object, it moves as per the instruction given as an input and layer is constructed. Applications of SLS. Here we can able to fabricate the complex and durable production parts. We are using production grade plastic, so we can able to fabricate production grade. Investment casting patterns, jigs and fixtures and tools, medical devices. Low volume production with high mass customization is possible. Automotive component design, example car dashboards, impact resistant parts, and complex durable parts. These are the applications of our SLS technology. Advantages of SLS parts have high strength and stiffness. We are using production grade plastic material, so the parts possess high strength and stiffness, good chemical resistance. It can be substituted for injection molding plastics. The part strength is depends upon the size of the powder particle. If you reduce the size, the strength of the object will be increased. So we can able to fabricate the component. The strength will be equal to the injection molding. Also, it's a fastest attitude manufacturing process. We can able to uh, fabricate the component in fastest time. Post processing is possible. No need support structure. Loose particles will act as a support structure, so there is no need of removal of support structures. Even though number of advantages, some disadvantages is there. Parts have porous surface because the powder particles we are using, so there is no chance to completely melt. There is a some porous structure, so it will reduce the quality of component. Brittle property. During solidification, object surface particles also heated. So the surrounding of surface powder particles also heated. When it is reused, it affects the product quality. Need separate cleaning system to remove the parts because we are using powder. So build common should be removed after the construction. It should be removed completely from the powder. So it should be cleaned after the object building. So it's a need separate cleaning system. These are the some drawbacks in our SLS technology. Thanks for watching, subscribe and share with your friends. Thank you.